Kuna kitu wanaita privatization. Obinafzia, what do you call it? Kiswahili ni kigumu kidogo, but mambo ya kuhakikisha kwamba watu ama rasmali za kibinafsi zinakuja kwa sectors zetu. Sasa watu wanageuza maneno wanasema oh uh, president uh, anataka kuuza uh, mali ya Kenya na nini? Mimi nataka niambie watu na hata sasa tukumbuke. At one time hii benki inaitwa Kenya Commercial Bank was 100% government of Kenya. It was basically a parastatal. Pole pole hisa zikauzwa zikauzwa hata through the stock exchange na kwingine Kenya Commercial Bank the government reduced its shareholding to about 30%. The rest ni shareholders wengine. And today Kenya Commercial Bank is the biggest bank in East and Central Africa. An asset ya hapa kwani mtu alingoa Kenya Commercial Bank hapa ameenda nayo Siko hapa Haya tukienda kwa posta tulikuwa tunaita Kenya Posts and Tele Communications wakafanya privatization ndio hiyo safari kop Mimi nawauliza sasa Kenya government is about again 30% shareholder roughly there in safari kop hiyo ingine yote iko na watu makampuni ya Uingereza raia wa Kenya kupitia kwa stock exchange na kadhalika today the biggest taxpayer in Kenya is hiyo safaricom there you are privatization juzi serikali ya Uingereza kupitia Heathrow Airport. Hiyo Heathrow Airport wengine mmepitia hapo. Heathrow Airport 12% share ya Heathrow Airport imenunuliwa na Saudi Investment Fund. Saudi Arabia kupitia kwa investment fund yao wamenunua hisa of which is worth 12% share ya Heathrow Airport. Sasa mimi nataka niulize wa Kenya ambao wanalalamika. Kwani wakipima watu wa Saudi Arabia wameenda wamengoa Heathrow Airport kutoka London wamepeleka Saudi Arabia. Ama bado iko London. Lakini wamechukua sasa zile investment kutoka Saudi Investment Fund ili zitengeneze mambo huko Heathrow so that they continue to expand the airport. That is how you bring capital. So what the president is seeking and is putting across is how do we raise capital other than taxing Kenyans all the time? What are the other ways we can raise capital ili tujenge taifa letu? Na haya yote akisema there is a law. There is a privatization act in a petition of parliament. So even parliament recognizes the word privatization and it is in our statutes it is not illegal what we should challenge is whether we are doing it in accordance with the law but not the principle of privatization na hii ni message mimi niliona nisikume kwa sababu watu wanarusha mambo ya porojo ati kujaribu kusema mheshimiwa ruto ati anauza mali ya Kenya wacha porojo There is nothing like that. And even when you privatize, there are those that will go through parliamentary process. Kwa hivyo hii ni mambo ambayo ni vizuri tukisimama imara itakuwa sawa. 